Among the ninja, there's a type of energy meditation called Kujikiri, or the Nine Hand Seals, which is a form of esoteric Buddhism derived from the Buddhist traditions of Shingon and Mikyo. These sects are considered esoteric or occult because their meditation practices, unlike those found in Zen Buddhism, make use of magic rituals intended to alter reality on some level. This is often interpreted as actual spell casting, which is one reason people associate it with the mysterious ninja. However, like all schools of Buddhism, the real concern of the esoteric sects is the spiritual enlightenment of the practitioner, and the so-called spells are intended to purify and focus the mind of the person using them. The Kujikiri, or Nine Hand Seals, are symbolic gestures that are made by crossing the fingers over each other in specific patterns across the palm. It may look mysterious at first glance, but the hand seals are essentially methods of meditation. Each hand seal is associated with a particular quality of psychological and spiritual energy, which can be invoked by the ninjutsu practitioner when he needs that quality for a specific task. As in all other forms of Buddhism, the sects that created the nine hand seals were primarily concerned with enlightenment, not victory in war. However, the samurai and ninja both made use of these meditative techniques in order to harness the untapped energies of the mind for success in battle. There are different meanings associated with each symbol. For that reason, in order to activate a certain ability, the correct symbol must be performed first. The Kujikiri, Nine Seals. Rin, power, strength of mind, body, spirit. Before any other Kuji can be effective, this one must be performed first. Power is channeled throughout the body, and it is associated with increased mental concentration as well as energy generation. This was traditionally done during battle preparation or training. The visualization for this Kuji is a fire, or raw energy. It is associated with the root chakra, and once purified, becomes a catalyst for activating higher chakras. Mantra. I am empowered with vital energy, or I am strong. Pyo, energy, energy direction. The energy channeled by Rin is directed or controlled by the complex Kuji of Pyo. The energy within the body is connected to the energy outside of the body. Moreover, it is associated with the beginning of the soul's journey toward higher levels of spiritual consciousness through the second chakra which is located in the lower Dantian. In this area, which is about two inches below the navel, there is thought to be a reservoir of vital energy. The visualization is an intensely bright light that flows with one's breath. Mantra, I am not tempted by distractions, or I am fearless. To, harmony, oneness with the universe or self. Connecting with the universe and meditating are important parts of being a shinobi. Tokuji is calming and intuitive, resulting in better harmony and balance, and a deeper connection to one's environment. The third chakra focus point is the solar plexus and adrenal glands, which activate one's fight or flight response. This is a visualization of a bright light building in the solar plexus and the observation of the changes in its color. Mantra. I forgive all past and present injuries, offenses, and slights. Or, I am in harmony with the infinite divine energy. Sha, healing of self and others. Through the Tao, one is connected to the universe and its vibration. With the Sha, you can summon that harnessed energy to heal yourself and others. Healing arts often use this method which is based on the idea of increasing one's own vibration. This hand seal is closely associated with ki, which is said to be the energy force or center of the body, as well as the heart chakra. It is considered to be the boundary between the lower and higher spiritual realms. The visualization is a bright light emanating from the chest. Mantra, I am healed, or divine energy flows through me, healing me and others. Tune into yourself and take action towards the life you've always wanted. And that's why we recommend Skillshare. If you want to learn more about this topic, Skillshare is the perfect place to start. This platform has thousands of classes from different categories that will provide you with a lifetime's worth of experience and knowledge in such short periods of time that there's no excuse not to try it out.
There is a class I highly recommend. It's called Modern Meditation. Discover your potential, power, and purpose. Created by Justin Michael Williams. In his Skillshare original, Justin will help you take action towards the life you've always wanted with an exclusive 10-day meditation experience. In just 10 minutes a day, and with Justin as your guide, you'll identify the aspects of your life that need the most attention, break through self-sabotage and fears getting in your way, and visualize your dream life and take action steps towards it. You've got to take this class, and because Skillshare is today's video sponsor, it's totally free. They are offering you one month of premium Skillshare absolutely free if you click the link in the description. Now, let's get back to the video. Kai, intuition, premonition of danger, feeling others' intent. This enhances a person's sensory awareness of their surroundings, including their emotional state and premonitions of danger. These outer bonds are the energy currents that precede an event. The fifth chakra is related to the throat, as well as the thyroid gland, which regulates the body's metabolism. Therefore, the area of visualization is the throat. Mantra, I see, feel, and know the eternal connection between myself and everything else. Or, I am psychic. Jin, awareness, feeling thoughts of others, perhaps hiding your own. Despite its apparent similarity to intuition, awareness goes much deeper and may even seem intrusive, allowing the practitioner to hear others' thoughts while shielding their own. This high-level kuji requires delicate care. You will be able to perceive with more clarity if you do not judge what you perceive from others. Associated with the pineal gland, the sixth chakra is said to be the gateway through which the soul meets the Holy Spirit. The visualization point is the center of the head directly behind the eyes. Mantra, through the infinite, I know the mind of each and all. Or, I am humble and knowing. Retsu, dimension, control of time and space. In theory, the Kuji opens the practitioner's mind to the perception of different flow patterns of energy, allowing the practitioner to control time and space. The idea is that all matter is composed of energy waves that are continuously recreated throughout the universe. Visualizing this recreation alters the perception of time. A technique like this could prove crucial in a mission or battle, among other areas. The pituitary gland, which is considered to act as a third eye, corresponds to this gland. The visualization point is at the top of the head. Mantra, I am the manifestation of manifested reality, or I am charismatic. Zai, creation, understanding nature. While the Tokuji connects the practitioner to nature in a meditative and harmonious way, the Zai provides elements with a level of control. This can mean control of natural elements such as the sky, river, trees, and even animals to assist the practitioner in their intention. The Zai Kuji has no corresponding gland or chakra. The visualization is a large stream of light radiating from the lower chakras and extending upward. Mantra, I manifest reality, or I am the consciousness of the laws of nature. Zen, absolute enlightenment. According to mainstream stereotypes, the Zen Kuji offers a skill often attributed to ninjutsu. This is invisibility or illumination. The idea is that at this level, one's vibration is so high that others operating in the common mind cannot register his or her presence. The Zen focal point is the expansion of the heavens, and the visualization is that of an infinite vast light filling a void with oneself as a part of it. Mantra, I am the void and the light. 